Hey guys, we're just going to do a quick recap of some of the modes that we've encountered uh, in Ear Training 3. Um, so behind me we have the major scale with the solfege written be, uh, below it. Remember that the apostrophe indicates an octave above the starting note, just as a comma would represent in a note an octave below. So uh, here we have the major scale. We're going to sing through it uh, just to refresh our memory. I'm going to go and get a note. Uh, and then uh, we'll start getting into the modes. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do. That's the major scale. So the first one we looked at was the Lydian mode, which we remember it's a the alteration of a major scale is the raised fourth degree. And we can also think of it as a, uh, the fourth mode of the major scale. So if we were to take the C major scale, start on F and go far, all the way up to far, we would get a, uh, a Lydian mode. But it's probably a little bit more useful and practical to think about it in terms of raise the fourth scale degree of the major scale, which is far. Okay? So how do we raise it by a semitone? F becomes F sharp. Remember that just because you see the sharp symbol here, it doesn't mean that you have to put a sharp in front of it. It, it means you need to raise it by a semitone. It's a really common thing for students to get uh, confused with when you see sharp four or sharp five or flat seven, which we'll get to in a minute. They think, oh, we'll just put a sharp in front of it. No, it just that's just a shorthand to say raise by a semitone or if you're using a flat, lower by a semitone. So, if we're raising the fourth scale degree by a semitone, we keep the same consonant, but we change the vowel to be brighter sound. So R becomes phi. Right? So, let me just check my note again. Oh. <coughs> so the hand sign change the hand sign changes too. So instead of Do Re Mi Fa, which wants to fall down to me, right we go. Do Re Mi Fi, which wants to go to Sol. Right? So let's go the uh, the hand signs for the Lydian mode. Do, here we go. Do Re Mi Fi Sol La Ti. Back down again. Do ti la so fi mi re do. So yeah, that's the Lydian mode. Let's look at the Mixolydian mode now, which is the fifth uh, fifth mode of the major scale. So the Mixolydian has uh, a flattened. Seventh scale degree. So we're no longer raising the fourth. So we're going to change this back to far. We're, we're flattening the seventh scale degree. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's a B. We lower that by a semitone, becomes a B flat. Same thing, uh, but in reverse. When we change the, the when, when we alter the scale degree, Consonant stays the same, it's still t, still t, but the vowel goes darker this time, so it's t becomes t, right? So, here we go, do, I'm going to say that's right, sorry for you with perfect pitch. Um, <coughs> and, sorry, the hand sign changes too, so rather than t, do, it becomes t, do, again, T wants to fall to La rather than T wants to go to Do. Let's sing it. Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Te, Do. Back down again. Do, Te, La, Sol, Fa, Mi, Re, Do. Yeah. So that's the Mixolydian mode, the fifth mode of the major scale.